Ramsey, your, your country's contribution to show jumping has been huge over the last year or two. This is the second year of the Furus here. Made a lot of difference to show jumping, hasn't it? Uh, certainly it has. I mean, uh, uh, for the Nation Cup uh, is now everyone's focus, you know, uh, everywhere in the world. Uh, certainly we can see that in our region here. Everyone is really focused to come and prepare and uh, ready to uh, get that qualification done. And if, uh, everyone is trying to, to be in the finals. And that gives us, uh, you know, gives the Forosia Nation Cup a really uh, high level of importance in our side and I think everywhere in the world. It's very noticeable that countries now from the Middle East are very strong in show jumping. They have some wonderful results, and yourself included, of course. Uh, well, uh, it's a passion, you know, uh, the, the horses industry in the Middle East is, is really big. And uh, now, uh, you know, we learned a lot from uh, the Europeans and uh, the Americans and everyone who has been in that sport for a while. And uh, we have really nice young uh, talents uh, coming up. So it's nice to see uh, that uh, you know uh, these people have chance to to come and and uh, do it worldwide and uh, have a, the opportunity to to compete against the best as well. I wouldn't go as far as calling you an old guy, but you've been around a long time at the very highest level. Uh, well, uh, you know it, it takes it's experience. You know, experience is very important. Uh, we we have uh, some experience in our team, which gives us a little bit, uh, uh, you know, depth in uh, in the team, and uh, and I think it's really important to have that in each team, uh, such as uh, Germany. Uh, Ludger Birbaum uh, is one of the you know uh, you know experienced, most experienced guys in there, and uh, that's what we want to try to mix a little bit the experience with the young uh, young talents coming in. It's nice to be competitive with nations of that strength of Germany and Holland, France, Great Britain, all those sort of nations, isn't it? Well, the chance to compete against them, that's already uh, a plus for us. And then the, the chance to maybe have achieve uh, an, uh, you know, uh, a result, that's also uh, something and it keeps us motivated and going. And uh, that's the good thing about the uh, horse riding, you know. That, uh, nowadays you uh, don't know who's going to win and uh, there's a lot of names up in the board. In fairness, though, to you, you know, you, your Olympic record is second to none because you go back to Sydney, do you? Actually, Atlanta. <laughs> so, Atlanta. Uh, so there's, yeah, there's five, uh, five Olympic Games and uh, I'm still looking forward for another five. <laughs> Just looking forward to, you know, here in Alain, it's going to be a very strong Nations Cup again. You qualified here last year, Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. Yeah, it's going to be uh, strong, you know, uh, uh, it's going to be under floodlights, so we, uh, we don't know how the horses are going to react, and, uh, but it's the same for everyone, we're going to go and do our best, and uh, hopefully qualify again, and that's, uh, that's everyone's uh, ambition here from all the other nations competing. You, of course, won the bronze medals in London in the Olympic Games last year, which was great for you. Uh, do you have the same team here? Uh, more or less the same same riders, uh, some change in the horses. Uh, you know, uh, I think we're missing two two of these horses uh, uh, in the team. Uh, but uh, you know, we're gonna give it also a shot and try our best. Well, we look forward to another good competition. Wish you lots of luck. Thanks for your time. Thank you so much, and thanks for FAI TV to give me that opportunity.